20 years ago, my older brother Ivan and I were sent on a mission to find and destroy a British intelligence base hidden in northern Russia. We were under the command of Captain Volkov, my late father's best friend. It was the first step of my glorious destiny. This is how it all started. It was a long time ago, and the Soviet Union was still alive. I was only a sergeant back then, by the side of my older brother, Ivan Romanov. Grigory, start. Captain Volkov is waiting for us. Yes, brother. Let's go. We were sent at the northern edge of the motherland, where the British had set up a secret base to monitor Russian activity. Once we discovered them, we were ordered to wipe them out, as such actions were not tolerated from the USSR. It was a different time, a time when our enemies were not forgiven so easily. Gather up, troops. The British base is just behind this hill. Our mission is simple. Eliminate any British military presence in the area. Lieutenant Romanov will lead the assault. Get yourselves ready, men. We will begin the attack shortly. Lieutenant Romanov, I want you and your squad in the tent for a moment. Everyone else, stand by for assault. Yes, sir. Ivan, I want you and your squad to lead this assault. I'll keep sending in troops to support you. But you boys need to know that this is bigger than you can imagine. The British hold an intelligence storage room in the basement of their HQ. We must acquire a document with the ID of A-435. It contains critical information about destabilizing our motherland's political system. Even plans for the collapse of the Union. Listen, Ivan, I count on you to get the document, but keep it between you and your squad. If we burn this base down, we will only get a medal. But if we acquire the document and prevent our enemies from holding it, we will return home as heroes. This information was very hard to get. Many good men died to deliver it to us. Let's make sure their sacrifice didn't go in vain. Now go, my boys. Yes, Captain. Everybody, on me. Let's go. It doesn't sound like an easy mission, Ivan. I know, Grigor, but we will do anything for the Soviet Union. My brother loved Russia as much as he loved our mother. Despite being my brother, his loyalty and devotion to freedom was making me sick. I never believed in freedom. As long as it exists, there will never be stability. There's a cab, but this is just the front door. Grigori, attack in your shop. Which way, Ivan? Keep pushing to the left flank!
That looks like their headquarters. It is their headquarters. Okay, the front. We have to get inside. Ah, On the balcony. We're coming from inside. Push. Go, go, go. Clear. Clear one, regroup downstairs. Yep, double cough. We have secured the headquarters and you're about to investigate the basement. Good. Well done, boys. Now listen carefully. Keep the rest of our men out of the HQ. Don't let them know about this. I want only you and your squad to investigate the basement. Get down there and find the document file. Remember, the AD is A435. Make me proud, boys. No worries, sir. We will get it for you. Igor, Igor, Pavel, Oleg, call me. Downstairs. Everyone else, hold position outside. We had captured the British headquarters. Securing that file was going to make us glorious. I was ambitious that one day I would become someone great. And this operation was my chance. This way. Follow me. Careful. This should be it. Looks like they stockpiled. It would take us hours to find the right one. Here, this section says top secret operations. File ID is A435. Keep looking. Normally, I would deliver the document to my captain, and he would get all the honors. But once I got my hands on that file, I realized that I had to be the only survivor. This way, I would get all the glory for myself and become someone great. I was ready to fulfill my destiny. I killed my brother and my squad, and I didn't stop there. I had to kill all who stood between me and my captain. Grigori, what are you doing? Why? For Mother Russia. I had found enemy body armor in the HQ. I used it to protect myself, as I was alone against the rest of my platoon.
Hold your fire. It's Sergeant Romanov. Sergeant, we heard gunfire. What happened? We are the others. As I was closing to my captain's tent, I felt the might of my power growing stronger, and destiny calling me aloud. Grigori, what are you doing? I didn't believe them on the radio. You can't be a spy. I knew you since you were a young boy. Did you even kill your own brother, your own blood? What do you think you will earn from this? Power. 